plasma, an amazing state of matter that brings the warmth of the light to our planet, allowing life to flourish in all its glorious forms. For a mere human, however, it may even be dangerous. But what is plasma and how can we use it? Join us in a grand adventure in the world of science! And take your knowledge to new heights as you learn about the technologies of past, present and future. Welcome to Captain Corrosion. My name is Agnes and today you will learn more about plasma, which is one of the five states of matter. It is said that plasma is by far the most common state of matter in the visible universe. For instance, when you take a glimpse at the night sky through a powerful telescope, you can see a vast amount of galaxies of different shapes and sizes, every single one of them consisting of countless stars. And the star is a huge hot ball of plasma held together by immense gravity that also drives the thermonuclear reaction at its very core, fusing lighter elements into heavier ones and emitting excess energy as light in the process. But in order to understand what plasma is, we have to go to a physicist who has brought the matter of stars down to the Earth. Luckily, we have one such guy right here in the Institute of Physics. Yes, come in. Hello, Indra. Can you tell us what plasma actually is? Yes, of course. Plasma is often called the fourth state of the matter. The first three are solids, liquids and gases. And if we first start with solid, let's say it's ice, and then put energy into it, it will start to melt. Then, if you put further energy into the liquid, it will start to evaporate and what we get is gas. These three are well known. And then, if you put even more energy into the gas, it will finally get ionized. And this ionized gas is called plasma. So, plasma is essentially ionized gas, which has some interesting properties. For example, it conducts electricity, and emits light. Fascinating! Can you show us something cool? We are after all in science lab. Sure. This may look dangerous. But there also exist cold plasmas, which have the same temperature as the surrounding air, and these can even be touched. Awesome! Can plasma be created only in a laboratory, or do we encounter it in our everyday life as well? Yes, indeed. In addition to lightning applications, which are visible to everyone, there are a number of other applications which have big impact on our lives. The biggest use of plasmas by market volume is in electronics industry where it is used to produce the tiny components of computer chips. It is also used industrially in the treatment of various surfaces, which are otherwise hard to coat or paint, for example polymers or textiles. Can plasma be used also in medicine? Yes, it is an exciting new area for plasma applications, as it has shown promise to be used in treatment of diseases and even cancer. Ion propulsion is one of the most interesting near-future plasma applications. 
It allows our spacecraft to travel vast distances to seek out new life and civilizations. The fusion reactors, however, will harness the power of the stars and turn it into electricity. Thank you for your time. No problem. Goodbye. My name is Agnes and I thank you for watching our short video about plasma. If you want to see more awesome stuff in the future, then click on this wall of plasma to subscribe and be sure to check out our website. The links are in the description.